In this video, I'm going to show you how to download the simple voice chat mod for Minecraft 1.21. The first thing you want to do is you want to open up any web browser and look up simple voice chat Minecraft download. And then go ahead and select on the official curseforge.com website. You should be greeted by a page that looks something like this. And the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be going to the right menu where it says game versions and we're going to pick out what version of Minecraft we are trying to get voice chat on. So for this video, we're going to be getting voice chat for Minecraft 1.21. So all we're going to be doing is I'm going to be pressing on view all and over here we have a list of all of the different versions of simple voice chat. Now additionally, in order to actually download this mod, we will need something that is called a mod loader. And a mod loader essentially bridges the gap between Minecraft and whatever mod you are trying to install and we have multiple different options. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to download simple voice chat using Forge. So I'm going to go ahead and use the Forge mob loader. But if you already have something like Fabric or NeoForge, then you could use those as well. But anyways guys, all you want to do is search for the correct version of simple voice chat that will work for your particular mod loader. So over here we got Minecraft 1.21 and we also do have it for Forge which is what we're going to be using in this video. So all you want to do is you want to go to the right and then select on these three dots over here and then go ahead and press on this option that says download file. And then just wait a little bit and then it will now download to your computer. So for clarity purposes I'm going to go ahead and just drag it out to my desktop just so you guys are able to see things a bit easier. Okay, now once you got that done, the next thing we need to do is we need to make sure that we got Forge installed. So all you want to do is you want to go to the official Forge website, which should be right over here. And now over here, we have all of these different versions of Forge. So all you want to do is you want to locate the correct version of Forge or the version of Minecraft that you are trying to get the simple voice chat mod on. So recall, we are working with Minecraft 1.21. So I'm just going to be selecting on 1.21 and then just select on this right over here and then go ahead and just press on installer. And then just wait a little bit and then go to the top right and then select on this button that says skip and now it will install the forge installer so again i'm just going to go ahead and drag it out to my desktop just so you guys are able to see things a bit easier and it seems like i already have it on my desktop so i'm just going to be pressing on replace file but do not worry guys this process will still work Okay guys, so now that we got these two files, the next thing you want to do is you want to right click on the Forge installer. And then you should see an option that says open with and then Java and then TM platform as the binary. Now for whatever reason, you do not see the option that says open with or see the option that says Java and then SE binary. Do not worry because all that means is that we need to install Java on our device. And thankfully downloading Java is incredibly easy. In order to download Java, all you want to do is open up another tab and then just look up Java download and then Oracle because because Oracle is the website where we can find the official Java download. So then just go ahead and press on Java downloads from Oracle and then you should be greeted by a page that looks like this. Now make sure that you do select on the option over here that says JDK21 because in order to run this mod we will need at least Java 21 so go ahead and just select on that and over here select on your operating system. So this will work whether you're on Linux, Mac OS or on Windows. I am personally on a Windows so I would go ahead and select on this and then install the X64 installer. And downloading Java is incredibly essential. It's really important because it will allow you to run things like Optifine, mods, all that good stuff. So it's honestly really good if you have it installed. Okay guys, so now that you install Java, all you want to do is locate the forward installer, right click on it again, press on open with, and then select on Java TM platform as the binary. And then a menu like this will appear and make sure that install client is selected. And over here, it will tell you exactly where in your PC it is going to install Forge. So go ahead and just press on OK after that. And now it'll begin to install Forge for Minecraft. So go ahead and just press on OK. And then the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be opening up the Minecraft launcher. Okay, once you're in the Minecraft launcher, it should automatically change your installation to the Forge download that we downloaded previously. However, if you do not see over here that it says Forge, make sure you go over here to where it says installations and over here where it says versions make sure the box that says modded is actually turned on because this is considered a modded version of minecraft and once you turn that on go ahead and press on this button that says new installation and then manually look it up here in the version selection but anyways guys thankfully i was able to find my forge installation over here so if you see it right here then you are good to go you don't need to do anything else okay so the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be locating the forge installation and mine is right over here then you want to go to the right and then you want to select on this folder icon right over here. So just press on this and then you will notice that we will get a bunch of folders over here. And all you want to do is locate the folder that is called mods in all lowercase. So my mods folder is right over here. Now, if for whatever reason you do not see a folder 
folder that says mods do not worry because you can easily make one by just right clicking over here pressing on new and then pressing on folder and then calling it mods in all lowercase so anyways guys i'm just going to be opening up the mods folder like so and now what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be dragging in the voice chat mod inside of my mods folder so go ahead and just drag and drop it like this and then you are good to go you can go ahead and exit out of the mods folder and then load back into the minecraft launcher select on play over here make sure that forge for whatever version of minecraft is selected then go ahead and press on play again and just wait for a little bit because now it will begin to open up minecraft and as you're able to tell yep we do have forge installed over here in the bottom left it will tell you that we do have some mods loaded in so all you want to do from here is go ahead and load into a brand new world or an existing world that you already have all right guys so now that you're in your minecraft world all you need to do is press on the v key on your keyboard and then it is going to actually give you like a short little tutorial on how to use simple voice chat or if you already know what you're doing you can go ahead and skip on it so it really is up to you so as you're able to tell yep you can now configure the mod from here if you guys found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. I will see you in the next tutorial.